Cora and Gunnar have a really epic journey. There's a lot of twists and turns, especially this time. Sophia, starting with you, what was your favorite part of her journey so far? She's got some really dark moments and some really bright moments. I mean, the my favorite part of her journey is to be able to explore something that was as dark as what was written and finding the ability or the opportunities to come out of it and come out to the other side. And because I wanted so desperately for her to have that chance for an alternative that that I was just, I just enjoyed finding those little pockets of moments of joy, of happiness. And um, and also for the journey of Gunnar and, and Cora, I mean, that's how the movie opens. It opens with with them too, and you can from the very beginning you can the the, the, the dynamic is palpable. Mm. So exploring how it evolves and and the courage that he that he takes and how he ends he ends up saving us and 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 really I think he saves Cora, so Cora's heart. And I think that there is something to say about that. And he, you know, a, a lot of the time. I think men are not written as gentle as gentle and sensitive as as you were and and my characters usually are played by men mm-hmm. with that sort of like physical strength and I think it's nice to see the roles a bit reversed yep. but still um there is a, a a palpable and a real safety in 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 Gunnar's character that is not what sort of the how we anticipate or how we think of a man to be but actually that's a real man very well said. What about you, Mikhail? What was he like to embody and, and play this this side that matters so much to Cora? I mean, it was a lot of fun and um, also very exciting that he has such a transformation that he goes through, you know, from being a very a humble farmer, a bit of a naive guy in the beginning, um, that he really steps up to the plate and, and becomes uh, almost heroic in his own right uh, by the end of uh, part one. But what he's not doing yet is is really being straightforward with Cora in his feelings about her. And, uh, and it was exciting to play, uh, to work on part two, where these characters are all, all with their backs against the wall, and they're and they know that imminent danger is uh, is face. They're all facing imminent danger, and and it forces him to uh, to come out, you know. And um, because if he, if not now, then maybe never, you know. I know this is hard, Sophia. You you had a tough time with this last time I spoke to you, but is there a favorite moment from filming this one? Because there's some real kick ass scenes here where it's just like action 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 did anything stand out that was kind of a blast to film so many moments <laughs> go on uh, I, i'm well the first thing that comes to mind now is that final final moments that, that we have with noble mm-hmm. you know cause that whole sequence uh takes place uh like on the floor of a, of the spa, the big spaceship, as it's tilting. So we had to shoot that. It, I mean, it took probably about a week or two to mm-hmm. shoot the entire sequence. Two weeks. Two weeks, and we had like, um, and that was actually the greenest world probably yes, that we've been true. in because all of that, the floor that we're sliding on, down on, is basically uh, was a green, like tilted floor mm-hmm. about I would say uh, fifty feet long, and we would have to walk it up every time. It was tough on the calves. And <laughs> <laughs> it was and, a hike every single time. We were right. hiking for and two we, weeks. And we would literally Have you ever been on. on a two weeks hike? That's what we did. That's what we did. And we would literally hike up, hang at the top, because, you know, because it was really at an angle. We were ready for Everest And at then the end. waiting for, like, a camera to roll, and then we would just slide down and do our action. Um, the way it came together in the edit, though, was really blew my uh, blew my mind I, I thought it looked so cool yeah yeah same it was the, the same I've never seen it in a film and I've never experienced anything like it and uh, yeah that's amazing well congratulations for making it through that that's fantastic thank you so much for the <laughs> thank time thank you of course thank, thank you, you.